Riders revving up the motorcycles, a drop of the flag, the field is away. Mercier, number 11, will lead it in at turn number one, and then heavy traffic through that very fast first turn. Ryder off the racetrack, going for a tumble. It is Steve Dick getting up. He appears to be okay, but his motorcycle, there was a second rider, that is Claude LaRue, who has also crashed here on the opening lap. I think both riders are okay. Number 27, LaRue, really rolled with this machine, and here's a replay in slow motion. Dick simply loses traction there in the first turn. The motorcycle goes end over end, shattering the fiberglass. Dick goes for a tremendous tumble. There's the second machine going for a flip. It is Claude LaRue, and both riders are very lucky to get out of here with just a few scratches. Both got up right away. Pat, I can't believe how these guys can throw their bikes away like that and still get up and walk afterwards. It's amazing. Because of that accident, the race was red flagged and restarted with Vancouver's Gary Goodfellow grabbing the lead. Gary Goodfellow will lead Michelle Mercier across the line and in at turn one. And again, the motorcycle up through this very fast right-hand turn, about 85 miles an hour. Up the straightaway, Goodfellow still holds the lead. Mercier in second, McMurder running third on the number 24 machine. Gary Goodfellow along that short shoot between the two right-handers at the north end of the circuit. There's Tom Walter going off the racetrack, did a nice job of getting back on. Goodfellow through the left-hander at Moss Corner on the back straightaway. Gary Goodfellow leading, Mercier in second. McMurder a very close third place on the back straightaway. McMurder trying to outbreak Mercier into the turn and he's got second place. A beautiful pass by Reuben McMurder, number 24, as he got underneath of Mercier to move up into the second place position. Back on the front straightaway, Goodfellow leading, McMurder in second, Mercier right there in third, and 54, Peter Lusby out of Moncton, New Brunswick on a Honda runs back in the number four position. An outstanding battle up front here involving four riders. Into turn two, Goodfellow by about 10 bike lengths. Mercier going back into second place as this time he pulled the out breaking maneuver on McMurder, the two riders battling just inches apart. Look at Goodfellow, that left knee almost down on the pavement, similar riding style from Mercier, McMurder, and Lusby. We're seeing some outstanding action here in this Pro 750 Superbike event. Paul McMillan on a Honda having a dice back there with 87, Norm Murphy, another outstanding three rider run. Gary Goodfellow, your leader, coming on the front straightaway. Mercier followed by McMurder and then Lusby. Outstanding action here involving these four riders. McMurder on the Yamaha being challenged now by Lusby on the inside. Lusby takes over the third place position. So they continue to swap the top positions. McMurder back on the inside. He will go back in a third. There is Peter Lusby, number 54, off the racetrack. Lusby, who was battling for the lead, crashing. But here is your leader, Gary Goodfellow, coming out of the final turn. Goodfellow on the Suzuki checkered flag. He will win it. 11 Mercier in second. Number 19 there, a lap rider, Jill Bulduc. There is your happy winner, Gary Goodfellow, as he will congratulate and be congratulated by Michelle Mercier.